Welcome again to another full launch reveal. I am sharing today the electric pop and stir. Now you say, what is that? Well, let me show you. Here it is all collapsed just to show you that it's easy to store. I'm going to take the pieces apart. This is what does the stirring. The bottom part heats it. And the top is the bowl for when you are making popcorn and when you're serving your popcorn as well, it's a great bowl for that. We're not gonna do popcorn today. We're gonna do something else that maybe is a little bit more unique. I wanna show you something now. How cool is this? That the cord is in the bottom. Easy storage for everything. We are going to plug it in, make sure that it's turned off first, and then we're going to put the stir part on. We'll make sure that it's lined up and ready to go. And now, it comes with this easy little guide, and we are going to make candied nuts. So the first thing we're going to do is put one cup of almonds in. They can be raw or already um, roasted. We're gonna put a half a cup of sugar. Um, apparently I didn't have everything ready. Two tablespoons of water. And that's important. You don't want too much and you don't want not enough. So we're gonna put the two tablespoons of water. We're going to do a teaspoon and a half of cinnamon, and a tablespoon would be right up to this line, so we're gonna do just less than that. And our cinnamon is going to be available again this fall for holiday baking. That's something that everybody loves, and it will be available later this fall. Then I'm going to put half a teaspoon of our double strength vanilla, which will also be available this fall. And just a couple shakes of salt to finish it out. And I'm going to turn it to nuts. It's very simple. It's kind of intuitive. You don't have to do a whole lot of fancy stuff for this. But like I said, you can make popcorn. And this takes about six or eight minutes, but you could make popcorn in here. You could also do some other things. I've been hearing some people trying things like, uh, you know, those little oyster crackers you can get and you can season them, make dill or whatever. You could do a small amount of them in here or broken up pretzels. There are gonna be some great recipes for popcorn that you can fancy up your popcorn with color like using jello gelatin the dry gelatin and see when these nuts sort of get up on the sides you want to just push them around so that they're kind of evened out and the way you'll know they're done is when they get sort of a sandy look and it is smelling amazing in here so this pop and stir is $99 and you say, oh, that's a lot. But think of all the different things it can do. And just think about the holidays. You could be making these candied nuts, various flavors, various tastes for your friends and family as gifts. Put them in little prep bowls or little gift bags or whatever. Um, people love homemade things and especially food items. You know, that's a handy little addition to a gift or or an entire gift, you know, if you have maybe a salon that you go to or a, a medical place that you end up going a lot or just some other person that provides service for you and you want to give them a little treat, um, this would be an ideal thing for that. Look at these, how they're just spinning around and it's sizzling. You can probably see it and hear it sizzling. I wish you could smell it because it is pretty amazing. 
So what I will do is I will then um, post a picture of the finished product so you can see what it looks like. But when you're finished with this, you just turn it to the off switch and unplug it. This piece and the bowl are both dishwasher safe, super easy to clean, not a big deal at all. And I'm gonna tell you that you're gonna want one of these and you're probably gonna to wanna to give them as gifts. But here's the thing, you can purchase it or you can host a party and get it for half price or less. That's something to think about because it'll definitely be worth your time. And you know what I can do right now? I can walk away from this and I can come back and check it in a couple of minutes. It'll be doing its thing and I don't have to worry about it. And it's bubbling so much that I know it's gonna be done in no time. So I can't wait to hear what you think you would do with this and who you think needs this. Because I'm pretty sure you thought of someone already that you said they need this pop and stir. All right, I'll show you the finished product. Thanks for joining me. Let's get cooking.